I'm Paige Harris. I'm Melissa Hart. And today we're going to be showing you how to bake chocolate chip cookies. The first thing you need to do is preheat your oven to the temperature it says on your recipe. Ours says 375, so that's what I'll change ours to. You need to wash your hands, so I'll demonstrate that for you. Wash it. <laughs> How long is it? A, B, C, U? Whatever. Good enough. And now you can start cooking. To make your chocolate chip cookies, you first need to start out by mixing your dry ingredients in a smaller bowl. Two and a fourth cups of flour. Two and fourth. One teaspoon baking soda. Yep. And one teaspoon of salt. Okay. That's it for our dry ingredients, so we can put those off to the side for later. Next we're going to do the wetter ingredients in a bigger size mixing bowl. Alyssa's going to mix uh, three fourths cups of brown sugar. I kind of want to pack it into the measuring cup. One. Two. All right. And then three fourths cup of regular sugar. And half a cup of butter, which is just one stick, if you're using sticks of butter. There we go. Okay. And another half a cup of vegetable shortening, and we're going to use Crisco. And then we're going to use two large eggs. I'll crack them, or we can each crack them. And lastly, one teaspoon vanilla. All right, now we have everything mixed. Now we're going to get your cookie dough ready to put in the oven. You're just going to take two spoons and a little glob of dough on one spoon and scrape it off onto the pan. And it, depending on how big your cookie sheet is, is how big you want to make your cookies, your dough globs. 
If they're too big, then they'll melt together. Now your cookies are ready to bake, and you can put them in the oven that you preheated at the very beginning. And set the timer for however long your recipe says, and ours said 9 to 11 minutes. And once your timer goes off, you can get your pan out of the oven, which is probably going to be really hot. So you want to use some oven mitts, and get your cookies. Voila!